Hey everybody, Red October. Today's Friday. Well, we all know about the uh, the shooting last night during the BLM uh, rally in Dallas. Um, man, it's just crazy. It, it, it's it is definitely un, um, unbelievable. Uh, I don't know when the last event, or if there was ever in in our history of this country, that many police officers actually getting shot at one event at one time on the same day or night um, but this is definitely gonna do a shaking uh, up to this country um, let me start off and just say definitely uh, once they come out with the reports on if this if these are rifles these uh, these criminals uh, maybe want citizens of this country, but now turn criminals. Uh, what type of rifles they use, ARs, AKs, they're probably definitely going to uh, turn up the heat on those rifles and uh, magazines. And uh, so I expect the prices of existing rifles out there are going to go up. They're going to skyrocket. Um, I hate to say they're coming after your guns, guys, but they're coming after your rifles for sure, definitely. Um, not good. Not good for the uh, Second Amendment uh, gun enthusiasts, uh, gun owners, uh, shooters of America that like to um, go sport shooting, go uh, target practice, that just enjoy the the um, the fun of shooting uh, guns in general. But those rifles, the ARs and AKs, they're going to be going after those big time, I'm sure. They're going to go after, um, they're going to hit them hard, man. Ammo, magazines, uh, you name it. So if you haven't stocked up, probably now is going to be a good time to go ahead and do that now this summer because at the end of the year, I'm sure shit's going to get crazy. The other thing I want to just say real quick, and that is uh, there's just too many agendas going on. There's too many events going on. You got Second Amendment, uh, gun owners, um, non-gun owners uh, talking about no more guns and guns this and gun free zones you have your ISIS radical extremists who have caused events in this country um, you have your uh, gay movement uh, you have your um, BLM uh, Black Lives Matter event going on uh, just last night um, we had the Oregon standoff uh, months ago um, it, there's just too much going on in this world instead of uniting and saying you know what in fact let me say this our president should use his platform as president and ask everyone on national TV please cease fire please let's just calm down let's get together as a country all races all um, organizations all type of groups whether you're in the lesbian community if you're the Second Amendment community that enjoys uh, your firearms or carrying your CHL holders uh, your BLM, uh, BLM groups every group out there that 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 has been in the news I'm not saying just wants a piece of the pie everybody wants attention I get it there's too many hands out there right now instead of Focusing on our country, uniting, making America great again, and 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 being uh, being your brother's keeper. I mean, we got too much stuff going on, and it's just getting crazier. I would say now would be the time to kind of buckle down, hold your tongue, don't go out there and start rallying, because right now. This uh, event's going to take away from a lot of the other events that are going on. Uh, of course, it centers around guns again. And I almost made a video, guys, yesterday. I, I swear, I almost released a video yesterday that I was talking about. You know, people want to go after uh, citizens' rights to carry guns. What if, what if uh, police officers were told, come August 1st or September 1st of this year, uh, we're doing away with firearms? I almost released that video yesterday, and I'm glad I didn't because uh, look what happened. I mean, it just goes to show police officers need guns too, right? Because criminals exist. Bad happens out there. 
I don't know guys it's just getting crazier and crazier and uh, this just gives them more reason to go after people's uh, rifles and yes AKs and ARs are at the top of the list then it goes down to your pistols and handguns and um, I would probably say uh, it's not good for any of us <sighs> be supportive right now to our uh, men and women in uniforms uh, that serve uh, as police officers I know some of you uh, feel otherwise differently but now's not the time to have hate on on any groups out there hold your tongue be positive unite as a country and uh, it's you know one of these guys uh, reported to the cops that got captured said the end was coming now I don't know if there's other people in this group that are out there that are waiting for the next event or what but uh, this shit's about to get crazy guys alright I gotta go Red October out